welcome to Daily Wellbeing with Gemma. This week I'd like to invite you to have a think about having a photo diary. So I've talked in previous videos about how beneficial journaling is, but not everybody's um, into writing for that long or they're worried about having ideas of things to write about. And so having a photo diary can be quite a, a good alternative. And you could pick a theme to go along with this. So it might be to take a picture every day of something that you're grateful for, something that made you smile, something you've achieved, or it might not even have a theme at all. It could be that you just take any photo that kind of captures something that spoke to you that day and that you keep it somewhere or possibly share it. A lot of people find that it can be motivating to share these with groups of friends or on social media accounts but do ask yourself whether that's going to work for you because some people find that keeping up something regularly on social media adds pressure for them and that they get caught up in comparing themselves to others. So it might work for you, it might not. And then what you might find is that you, you could just put a picture up on its own or you might want to write a little bit of a comment on, underneath or save the pictures with, with titles and things that explain what it is representing or what captured you that day. And that way you're journaling in a really short form. You're letting the picture do most of the talking, but you're getting a little bit of a chance to express yourself. And it might be that each week you have a different theme. Um, it could be that, right, this week I'm taking pictures of things outside or indoors or I want to remember pictures or I want to go through my old pictures and select, um, you know, memories from the past or it might be hopes for the future. Up to you how you do it. But having that kind of regular rhythm where you're building in a little bit of time each day to have a think about the picture, what it means to you and maybe to share that with others encourages all the benefits of journaling and keeping a diary while not having the same pressure of writing things. So if you are going to start this, have a think about how you want to take the pictures. Is it going to be something that you do on your phone with a proper camera? Could you take Polaroid pictures? Is that, you know, what's going to work for you? Are you going to share them? And if so, who, with and how? And are you going to have any sort of commentary that you you know, write things about them or are you just going to think about it inside your own head? Decide those things so that you can build up a little bit of a routine and then try it out for a week and see if it makes a positive difference to you. If so, you might find that it becomes a really nice way of, of um, you know, saving memories in the long term. So I hope you enjoy that. I'd love to hear how you get on and enjoy the rest of your week. See you next time. Bye.